We continue to follow that standoff in Velda City where they believe a man who police say shot and killed a pregnant woman and her toddler on Christmas Day is holed up inside. Our Kelly Hoskins has been following this case all day long. She joins us again from the scene with an update. Kelly, they've been out there for two and a half hours now. What can you tell us? Well, they are still out here. This is still a very active scene here in the 7100 block of Edison Avenue. As you can see, the St. Louis County detectives are still on the scene. We want to show you a picture as investigators ask us to release that picture of the suspect who they say is Timothy Brown. Now, Timothy Brown was considered armed and dangerous, and we're told that he had a history of domestic violence, and he was recently released from prison after making a, pre, a plea agreement. Let's go straight to Bomberito Automobile of Sky Fox that was over uh, the scene this afternoon as St. Louis County Prosecuting Attorney's Office issued those warrants late Monday afternoon for 30-year-old Timothy Brown, who is now charged with killing his ex-girlfriend and her two-year-old daughter on Christmas morning. Now, according to those charging documents, Brown is charged with two counts of first-degree murder and the killing of Sharnice Garvin, a mother of three who was also pregnant at the time, and her two-year-old daughter. St. Louis County Police remain on the scene here. Back out here live, we are hearing investigators here on the scene here talking uh, to Timothy Brown, who is inside of the home now, trying to negotiate him out of side of the home. We will continue to follow the story. And of course, we are going to have more on this tonight on Fox 2 News at 9 and 10. This is a developing story here in Belda City. Reporting live, I am Kelly Hoskins. Back to you in the studio.